Hello friends, welcome to Coding Garden. My name is CJ, and uh, if you're new here, hello. If you're not, welcome back. And I just wanted to talk about uh, the new chapter of Coding Garden. So if you didn't see the news on Twitter, and uh, I guess also YouTube and other social platforms, I am joining the Syntax team as a video creator. And uh, so in this video, I'm gonna talk about what that means for Coding Garden, what that means for Syntax, and everything in between. So if you're not familiar with Syntax, they are the biggest and best web development podcast out there. They've been going since 2017. They have over 700 episodes. And last year, in April of last year, they got acquired by a company called Sentry. So if you haven't heard of Sentry, they do error reporting, performance monitoring, session replay. Uh, basically, it's software for your software so you can write good software. And uh, they had been a sponsor of the Syntax podcast for a long while and decided that, hey, Syntax is actually getting us a lot of business, so instead of paying to be a sponsor, let's just buy the whole thing, <laughs> and they did. Um, I'll link in the description to the podcast episode where Scott and Wes talk with David Kramer, the CTO of Century, about uh, that acquisition, and also a link to a blog post where they talk about it as well. So that means Syntax is an organization that is owned by the Century company. So I am actually an employee of Century, and I'm on the Syntax team. Now, since that acquisition, the Syntax team has been working to expand their team. So they recently hired Randy as the podcast producer. And if you have seen the video podcast either on Spotify or I don't know if it's on other platforms, it's definitely on YouTube and Spotify. But if you've seen it there, that's Randy's doing. So he's been helping them record their episodes on video and then he's editing them down to be published as video podcasts as well as audio podcasts. So he joined the team a few weeks ago and then I'm joining the team as a video creator. So it's gonna be my job to expand the brand further by creating like YouTube videos, TikTok videos, Twitter videos, those those kinds of things. And I won't be on the, a regular on the podcast, but I might be on maybe once or twice a year. Now, if you're already following the channel, you probably already know that I am a live streamer for the most part. You will see YouTube uploads, but typically those uploads are just edited versions of the live streams. I'll basically take what I did live and then chop it down so it doesn't last four hours and it's a bit more consumable for people that are looking for YouTube videos. I have done some edited tutorials in the past. Like what I used to do is I would go live with the intention of recording a YouTube video. So I would go live on Twitch, but I would actually hide the chat and I would teach as if I'm recording a YouTube video. And those are some videos that you've probably seen on my channel, like the intro to TypeScript or the setting up a Vite and React app, those kinds of things. So the content that I'm gonna create for Syntax is gonna be similar to that, but ho I hope <laughs> um, better produced. So I'm gonna be editing and producing those videos. Um, but my plan is not to do them live, to plan them, prepare them, and make them as good and shiny and polished and entertaining and engaging as possible. That's my hope and my plan. So you might be wondering what's gonna happen to Coding Garden. It'll still be here, right right here <laughs> on, on the internet. You can still see it. Coding.garden will still exist, but I won't be streaming as often. So I'm probably gonna bring the streams down to about one a week, especially until I can find my cadence at work because I, my work with Syntax will be full time. So I have to figure out, well, am I gonna have enough energy in the mornings or the evenings to also stream on Coding Garden on top of that? But for the time being, the plan is at least one stream a week. So that means no more Try Day Friday, at least for now. For now. <laughs> and that also means that Listed is going to take a little bit longer to complete. So if you've been following the Listed series, it, we, we got a lot of work to do. Um, and so it's still going to take a bit more for me to get all of that done. Now, if you're supporting Coding Garden monetarily through uh, YouTube memberships or Twitch subs or patron patronage on Patreon or as a uh, GitHub sponsor, I'm going to leave those enabled. But I realize that I'm not posting regularly, so if you don't feel like I deserve the monetary support anymore, that's okay. You're, you're more than welcome to unsubscribe or, or disable the renew of that. Now, with that said, if you want to support me now, you should follow Syntax everywhere because my, my job depends on it. Um, I mean, not really, but it kind of does. So uh, subscribe on YouTube. There'll be a link in the description. Follow them on Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, LinkedIn, everywhere they are on the web. Subscribe, listen on Spotify or Apple Podcasts or wherever you get your podcasts. Synta I am Syntax, Syntax is me, so if you support Syntax, you're supporting me as well. So that's it for this update. More than likely, the next time you will see me is over on the Syntax channel with a, a new video. So I'm excited for that and I'm working on that. And yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm excited for this ne next chapter of Coding Garden. I hope you, you follow me uh, along 
in that journey. And uh, wherever you are in the world, have a wonderful morning, afternoon, evening, or night. Thank you.